dynamic stretching. Yeah. Hey everybody, welcome to Seriously Lighthearted Yoga. We've been doing kind of a subsection here about stretching and, and getting deeper, sort of stretching out your muscles, getting more flexible in Wait, various different, yeah. yeah, yeah, various, <laughs> like, whatever, yeah, um, in various different ways. We've uh, spoken to you about doing this and uh, we want to give you some precautions, some things to look out for, things to be aware of and things to, uh, things to, things to know. Yeah. So guys, <laughs> you like that? So guys, there are <laughs> a few things that I would recommend you look out for when you're kind of working on the stretching and the flexibility side of yoga. Uh, the first thing to look out for is a sore muscle. So if the muscle is sore, it is sort of inflamed in a short in a <clears throat> short term sense. Or if you do have any sort of inflammation in a muscle for some reason or other, uh, recognize that that muscle isn't going to stretch. <laughs> and you can try and work it all you want, but as long as it feels sore and hurts a little bit like that, it isn't something that you're going to be able to kind of make longer. <laughs> so don't try. Just give yourself a couple of days for that muscle to kind of come back to a uh, normal functioning where it's not sore and trying to rebuild itself because that's what being sore is it's your muscle saying i need a break to kind of put things back together <laughs> give it that time uh, another thing i would look for is if you in your stretching are for some reason noticing say that your knees are becoming like really loose or have begun popping a little more than you used to or something that is a sign of sort of stretching out tendons versus muscles so when you're stretching look to stretch the muscle and not like the all the connective tissue in the joint say for example and i there are lots of different uh, postural cues that you can kind of hear and give or be given from your instructor that will help you kind of, again, activate the muscle and to use the muscle while you're doing this so that you are protecting your joints because, and I bring this up again, the ligaments in your joints, if you stretch those out, they don't bounce back into the same conformation that they had before. They're not like a muscle where they're gonna repair themselves. It may be that your joint becomes loose for life if you stretch it out too much. Uh, the tendons will take a very long time and may or may not ever get back to that same uh, confirmation that they were in originally. So trying to again focus on the muscle when you are stretching. Notice that you, or pay attention to using the whole muscle. You don't want just part of the muscle stretching at any one point. You would like to be using the whole thing. And again, these are things that your instructor can give you cues for and help you understand in class when they give you prompts for different asanas and things. And then uh, the final thing I'd like to say is a really, really helpful tip for becoming more flexible and stretching better is to drink a lot of water and be plenty or well hydrated. <laughs> uh, having blood kind of circulating around your muscles, like giving them a bath. And if you don't have water, you can't give them a good, as good a bath. So. Yeah, well, there, <laughs> there you have it. Seriously, lighthearted yoga tips for taking care of yourself, really yeah. your muscle. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah. Wash your wash your muscles with water. <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow.